ways that frustrate so many of you. They make your ride bumpy and can even damage your car. It's the subject of this week's Good Question with Pat Taney. Pat, you are not talking about potholes. Uh, not exactly, Nikki. Manhole covers, actually. A viewer asked me, why do they always seem to sink into the roadway? We've all been there. You're driving down the road and then... I'm constantly trying to dodge them to avoid damage to my car. They're typically, they're, they're recessed a little bit. So Jim Schwartz asked me, how come manhole covers are not necessarily even with the, the level of the road? There seems to be a pothole effect with manhole covers, even on newly paved roads. Why does this happen? Bill Wright, Commissioner of Public Works for Ontario County. It's never an exact science. You know, you got to try to match it. So it never, ever really matches perfectly. But of course, that's the goal. Here's the deal. When crews repave the road, they need special rings like this one to raise the manhole to make them even with the surface. But those rings are not one size fits all, meaning they don't work all of the time. Also, before any manhole is raised, the agency responsible for them, like let's say the sewer department, has to be consulted and work with highway crews. So it's a coordination between those two agencies that result in making sure those manholes are risen. I'm not saying it always takes place. Why do you think it doesn't always happen, the coordination there? Well, speculation is always difficult. Sometimes they think that, okay, I'm only going to put a three-quarter inch overlay. I, you know, so really I can't buy a ring that will it'll make it too high. So we know there's going to be a little bit of a dip. So sometimes it depends on the type of project that they're doing. And like I said, you can't always make it perfect. Uh, because the rings are only made certain sizes. That's the answer, but for folks like Schwartz, it's not an acceptable one. I'm an engineer, yeah. and I'm used to doing things kind of precisely, and I, I would just think that they could do a little better job. Highway crews understand that criticism. They say a little dip when driving over a manhole cover, though, should just be expected. But yeah. when it becomes a big dip, Nikki, one that really rattles your car, possibly even causing damage, you need to call the highway department and let them know. And they go on and fix it. But those little ones, the little dips, I mean, we just have to deal with this? Uh, yeah, especially in older communities like Rochester. You know, these utility holes were dug many, many years ago in the roadway. Uh, in new road construction or community construction, especially your subdivision, you were talking about this earlier, those manholes have now been moved to the yards off the roadways because of this very issue. Very interesting. Yes. Thank you, Pat. Yeah. And, you know, if you have a good question you'd like Pat to answer, shoot him an email. Just uh, email goodquestion at whec.com.